Hey, so how's everybody? And how's your week been? Uh, pretty good, I hope. Uh, so I'm going to get into uh, talking a little bit about staying focused. Um, I'm drawing this uh, goldfish slash koi. I don't know what I was doing. Probably just some very extra long tail goldfish. Um, but yeah, staying focused. Um, I get asked that a lot. Um, figuring, hey, maybe it'll help some other people uh, stay focused when they need uh, some motivation or some tips maybe on how to stay focused. Um, one, I draw all the time and it takes a lot to just, you know, do that day in and day out. Uh, one, I think the main thing is that you have goals set for what you want to do. Um, a vision and a plan. Those things help a lot for me to stay focused. Um, so I, I want to get sponsored by certain people or... I want to make a certain amount of money. Um, one, I just want to draw for a living and do art. So those right there um, are motivations for me. I uh, <clears throat> I have my stuff written down. I have like a three, five, ten year plan of how I want my life to look as an artist. Um, and, and you know sometimes I do get uh, wary and question you know is this what I really want to do or and, and you know I think that's normal with anybody and you just at some point you know talk yourself back into it um, how I stay motivated and drawing in general um, I don't know, I'll probably do, um, you guys know how I am about hands and anatomy. So hands, um, I'll draw those quite often. And they're, for me, they're really quick. I bang them out. Um, and that kind of just gets me back into, okay, I'm drawing again. Or I even go even simpler, I'll draw um, Hanna-Barbera old cartoons. You know, I'll just go on Google, search Yogi Bear, Flintstones, or whoever. Um, and then I'll just draw those things. Um, it helps me uh, get out of the funk I'm in. Um, again, because I know what my goals are, I know I need to draw constantly. Like, I can't afford not to um, draw. Uh, Excuse me, I can't afford not to draw two days in a row. Um, there will be some times where I don't pick up the pencil in a day or so. And it's mainly because I am doing um, some digital work or something for a client that you can't see or can't show. But uh, when I'm in those funks, I'll, I'll draw something real simple. Um like I said, Hanna-Barbera cartoons, Smurfs, anything, just something that I know I'm putting a pencil on paper. Um, yeah, so, you know, that, along with having a plan, um, staying uh, in touch with other artists that are maybe not doing the exact same type of art, but are very successful, always want to stay in contact with somebody who's maybe five to ten steps ahead of you if that's possible so you know they'll motivate you to do better and want to stay focused as well um, and those are you know people that hopefully are either in that field or already have their own business to stay focused and keep you focused um, so yeah that's that's uh, what is it? Have a plan and draw easy stuff to get you back into it.
Uh, looks like the video's about up, but appreciate y'all, and we'll talk again soon. Peace.